Flooding is the number one natural hazard affecting Harris County. While the Harris County Flood Control District cannot realistically control flooding, they do build projects that help reduce the risk of structure flooding throughout our county. For example, the Flood Control District builds large regional detention basins to temporarily store stormwater when our bayou system becomes overwhelmed. However, the Flood Control District does not have jurisdiction over other important aspects of our drainage networks, such as roadside ditches, storm sewers, or developed land. Instead, they rely on partnerships with several public and private entities. The City of Houston, for example, has its own criteria for design of its drainage systems, primarily the design of storm sewers and street drainage, but also stormwater detention for these systems. Other incorporated areas, which include the many cities located in Harris County, are also floodplain administrators and have their own drainage design criteria for road systems and development. In unincorporated areas of Harris County, the County Engineer's Office is the floodplain administrator. In all, there are 35 floodplain administrators within Harris County, and the Flood Control District is not one of them. There are also four County Commissioner's precincts within Harris County, each with jurisdiction over certain roadside ditches and detention basins. In all, with 35 floodplain administrators reporting to separate entities of government, there are nearly 250 elected officials involved in the administration of drainage and flooding issues in the county, including each municipality's building permit program that regulates development. In addition to local and county-level governmental entities, which have a role in Harris County's flood-related matters, the Flood Control District routinely coordinates with regulatory agencies such as the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, who has jurisdiction over attics and Barker reservoirs, and the Texas Commission on Environmental Quality to ensure that the Flood Control District complies with all state and federal environmental regulations. The Flood Control District also works closely with the Planning Division of the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers to devise large-scale flood damage reduction projects for approval and funding through Congress. During storm events, regional and national organizations such as Harris County's Office of Homeland Security and Emergency Management, the National Weather Service, and the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration rely on the Flood Control District's sophisticated flood warning system for valuable, real-time information. The system relies on gauge stations strategically placed throughout Harris County's bayous and tributaries, and the data collected from these gauge stations is used to help the community and emergency management officials make critical decisions that ultimately can reduce the risk of property damage, injuries, and loss of life. Given the terrain of Harris County, climate, storm patterns, and the considerable amount of jurisdictional interests, the Flood Control District is still meeting the challenges with great success. Practically speaking, preventing all flooding in Harris County is virtually impossible, but every project helps the community cope with flooding by helping to reduce the risk and frequency of damages.